It's all good. Hi. <laughs> so tell me a little bit about, uh, this is uh, day two of your project. Day two. So yesterday we put on the undercoat. Uh, so we've got our purples, our pastel colors, our the baseline for the ducks. And now I'm, I'm putting in the outlines for, for the ducks in their raincoats. So nice. I, made, I made sketches uh, last week. Um, got approved by Pioneer Square Alliance and now I'm putting them up on the wall in charcoal. So thank you for saving Pioneer Square. <laughs> well, thank you. Thank you, Sydney. It's, <laughs> it's just wonderful that you're here. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> and who else do we have here? And uh, I've got two helpers today. One of them is my brother, Miles Pirtle in the pink Hi, Miles. Hi. mask. And then his girlfriend, Leah Tirada. Hi there. Um, both of them are dancers for Pacific Northwest Ballet, which is not currently open. So they are volunteering their time to help me out with this mural. So How wonderful. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> yeah, you're doing such a nice job. It's so pretty, so vibrant, so fun. Thank so you. So happy. Aww. You know, it just, and it does uh, resemble the shop inside. I I hope so. I it hope does. so. It does. It totally does. I mean, Aga Designs is my favorite shop in Pioneer Square. So I I'm especially thrilled that I get to do this shop out of all the all, all the others. So and so um, the Pioneer Square Association are yeah. they delegating different buildings to different people? Yes. Yeah. So um, you can you can email uh, Sarah S A R A at Pioneer Square dot org with samples of your artwork and if you live and work here and then she chooses which store you'll get to paint. I actually specifically requested Agate Designs, so I'm really happy that I got it, but. <laughs> oh, how wonderful. Yeah. And, and Sydney, you were talking about another project that you guys do. Yes, yeah. Tell um, me about that. So uh, my brother and I both run this uh, production company called Sea Purtle Productions. Um, and we put on, uh, last November, we put on a giant art show of low income artists. We had 65 low income artists show work at the ballet. Um, and we, we sold over $31,000 worth of artwork for low-income artists nice. around Seattle. Nice um, to help them. Yeah, and well, and to get their names out there. It's really difficult to become famous as an artist in your own city. It's really easy if you're, if you're like, hey, I'm an artist, you know, to somebody, an art gallery in Chicago, and then, then it's exotic, you know? Yeah. But if you come to an art gallery here in Seattle and you say, I'm a Seattle artist, I worked on the street, and they just, you know. Nice. Hey, you know, never mind. So our goal is to go out and help low-income artists um, and incorporate dance. So bringing art and dance into uh, the Seattle area. And and so Miles is doing it too. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And so you do that too. And and so tell me a little bit about uh, the music, the dance, and ballet, and how you incorporate that into the homeless project. <laughs> well, we're just trying to do art around Seattle and make it all about the artists of Seattle. So that's that's our plan, whatever medium it is. Nice. So here we are. It's really nice. To do what we can. <laughs> oh, it's beautiful. <laughs> Thank you, Sydney. Thank and you. so now uh, you're starting it up today. I you're am. already working on it. Yep. And should be here until this evening and back again tomorrow. So oh, nice. well, we're going to check on you from time right. to time. Sounds great. <laughs> now, how do people get a hold of you if they're interested in that Art Homeless project? Oh, uh, our email is C Pertle, uh Productions. It's S E A P E R T L P R O D U C T I O N S at gmail.com. Um, but you can also find us uh, on Instagram uh, at under C Pertles. So, and it's under C Purtles. Yes, Purtles is our last name, and we chose Sea Purtles for Seattle Purtles and Sea Turtles. So, I like it. It's very nice. <laughs> well, thank it's you. wonderful. Yeah. So well, we're always looking for new projects, um, especially a way to bring um, low-income art to um, higher income levels here in Seattle. So. And do you do that once a year, the project for the homeless? Um, well, it's not just homeless artists. It's also just low income artists. Um, and there's plenty around here, especially in Pioneer Square. Um, we're doing it every opportunity we get. Nice. Uh, so especially if you know of any opportunities, please, please email us. So thank you. Yeah. <laughs> and, and thank you for being on my show too. My show yeah. is Public Interest Issue Show. Public Interest Issue Show. Thank you. Nice. Well, thank you so much. Thank you for saving <laughs> Pioneer Square. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> and now, uh... <laughs> you 
each little place is intricately done. complicated process because you have to paint over the plywood first yes yes definitely um, you can still see the plywood lines here if you look closely um, so we did about two coats on each side uh, and then the next color and then uh, and then we'll be putting on more color in the next day or so so nice. yeah Very nice. <laughs> it's fun to watch the process being created <laughs> well it, it's fun for us too so thank you <laughs> Yeah, thank you. <laughs> and, and what do you think? This is your shop. I think it looks good. Are is, you Sydney? I am. Aren't Mark. they doing a good job? Thank you, Mark. I, we love your sh your shop. Thanks. We love the agate shop. Hey. Don't worry about it. Hey. Yeah, very nice to meet you too. I, I love your shop, so <laughs> I'm so thrilled to be able to do this. Thanks. Well, I'm glad you like it. <laughs> um, question? Yes. Not about your art. Sweet. And now tell me a little bit more about uh, how you guys decided on uh, doing that art project for the low income. Um, well, I, uh, I'm a dancer at PNB, and um, I had the opportunity to choreograph on, for the company this year. And so I had a little bit of a platform to try to make a piece that I thought was important to Seattle. So I made a ballet with my sister and some other artists and uh, with that project grew a side project of putting on an art show in the front of house of only Seattle artists. So my ballet was devoted to Seattle and to people who live here. And if you didn't see it, it was called Wash of Grey. Uh, and then, yeah, then we had 60 local artists, over 60 local artists present work in the front of house. So all the ballet members would come in and see this art and be able to buy it or buy prints or buy postcards or stickers of whatever they could do. And then we gave 90% of all the proceeds right back out. And we only took a 10% commission, which. That's really nice. Uh, yeah. That really does was, help support the artists. It was a lot of fun. We had a lot of great volunteers m make it happen. So it was, it was something. Thank We're always you. looking for the next venue to put it on. So if you want an art show in the front of your house, we're the ones to call. Thank you very <laughs> much. Thanks for being on my show. Absolutely.